So the idea for Methodical Coffee started back in 2013 when Will Schertz, Marco Suarez, and I all had the same vision for a, a third wave coffee shop in Greenville, South Carolina. And from different angles, we had all seen this being done um, in other cities that we were living and decided Greenville is a great place to start a similar coffee shop. And as we had the vision for the shop, we realized that um, we'd, we'd also like to roast at some point. So quickly on the heels of opening the shop, we were already looking at getting into the roasting business um, to show Greenville that there could be a local company doing what other national roasters are doing at a high level. When we started the coffee shop, we wanted it to be a really inviting place. We wanted the whole city to feel welcome in it. We want to emphasize the fact that the coffee shop is for everybody. You know, it always has been, and we just want to bring that to the community and contribute to the culinary scene that's already kind of going on in Greenville. We wanted to take it a step further with coffee. Every package that we've done has required uh, some unique constraints. Um, for the cold brew, the constraint there was that it was going to be cold and it's going to be wet. And so we um, need a label that would work uh, with that in that regard, but that we could also write on because every bottle uh, has a brewed on date. And then lastly were the bags. So we came up with the idea of uh, adding a label to the front um, where we could um, specify the, the coffee information that would be unique for that coffee. So we worked with Frontier to uh, print those labels. Um, we worked with Frontier for the candles, for the cold brew bottles, and they've been extremely easy to work with, um, extremely helpful. It was great to work with people. It was most of these most of these things you get done online. And the nice thing about Frontier is that it's a very personal relationship. When Methodical Coffee first came to us, they really wanted an unlaminated material for their candles and their bags. But when they started their cold brew, they really needed something that was waterproof. So we switched to a white plastic with a matte laminate. So it gave the same look and the same feel, but was fully waterproof for their needs. Any question I would throw at them, they always had an answer, a quick response. It's a great relationship and one we plan to maintain for a long time.